question 12, write in the missing digits. So we've got two three-digit numbers added together makes 851. Now the trick with this one is how it's been set out in the question. It's been set out side by side, so it makes it very difficult to do anything with it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to set it out in the column method like we would normally do. So we've got four hundreds, some amount of tens and four, plus three hundred and eighty, and then some amount of units. And we know that the answer is 851. Now, the trick here is to start going through this like you would with a normal column method addition. 4 plus something has got to equal 1 there. Well, that is not going to work because 4 is already more than 1. So you've got to think, well, what could this 1 actually mean? Remember, in the column method, sometimes we go over 10. So the next number that ends in a 1 that goes over 10 would be 11. So this 1 actually must stand for 11. And now we can use that to help us. 4 plus 7 would be 11. And we would put the 1 in and then we'd carry another 1 underneath here. So now let's move on to the next column. Something plus 8 has got to equal 5. Now, 8 is already more than 5, so this 5 can't mean 5. So the next number over 10 that ends in a 5 would be 15. So maybe something plus 8 has to equal 15. Well, if I put a 7 in there, 7 plus 8 would equal 15, but then don't forget I've got this one that I carried over here, so that would make it one too many. So 7 is one too many, so it's actually got to be 6. 6 plus 8 is 14, plus that 1 down here would be 15. So you would put the 5 in and carry the 1. And then we'd have 4 plus 3 plus 1 would be 8. So it looks as though the two missing digits are 464 and 387. It would be a good idea at this point just to double check with our own addition column method from scratch to see what we would get. To see if we would get 851. So 4 and 7 is 11. Carry the 1. 6 and 8 is 14. Plus that 1 is 15. Carry the 1 again. 4 plus 3 is 7. Plus the 1 is 8. So indeed, we do get back to 851, which is what we want to get here. So we must have got the correct answers. So this missing number needs to be a 6. And this missing number needs to be a 7. And that is the final answer.